Here's a fun one for you. If you look at this build on the table, you think to yourself, well, hey slider, that's a Slayer Exciter of some type. It's got the little Tesla coil and a pills bottle. You've got your three turns at the bottom there. Bits of wire and such, no doubt a battery is going to be involved. But in fact, no. Just an earth ground, and these two leads out to the power speaker. Now normally I'd use one of those. An earbud type, but here we are. And there we are. It's working as a crystal radio. And it's picking up KBIX, a local station. So, the whole thing was, what I intended to do was to get away from that kind of a design, you know, your regular crystal radio thing. And I found out that by winding 80 turns, I could get reception uh, on a cardboard roll type of a thing. And I found out also that if I added turns, you can see I made a couple of mistakes here, or at least progressions in what I was doing. And then if I wound 180 turns of 30 gauge on a thin pills bottle, um, I actually got reception of KBIX. And then I also found out if I put the three turns around and I put a capacitor across there, added a small amount of wire on, the, on that line there, then the signal was further improved. And I looked at it and went, that's a really weird design. And so I thought I'd share it. So anyway, if we have a look at the, the circuit for it, it's all a very simple thing. It doesn't really look like a crystal set. But uh, the coil itself measures 0.27 millihenries, which I think uh, is where 1490 kHz AM is. So there we are, that is basically it. It's 180 turns of 38WG, 3 turns of about 28WG, and this diode here is a regular germanium. Uh, it's an old 1970s thing, we are rescued from, from an old circuit board. Uh, now, we went down to see KBIX and have a look at it, and I'll show that footage shortly. The lease on it is due to expire on the 1st of June next year, and it'd be a heck of a shame if that thing could be termed as a sort of warden cliff in a way, transmitting its power, and here I am picking up that power. And the place itself, um, the transmitter itself, is only 450 watts, which is half the power of a microwave oven. So even though it's only 3.5 miles away, and that small wattage, this is pretty interesting stuff to perhaps link across to Tesla's work. Okay, we're out here, about four miles away. KBIX Towers. I'm not sure which is which. Uh, the FM's 250 watts and the AM is 450 watts. But it's not looking in good shape and it's due to lose its license 1st of June next year, as I've probably already said, but this is the station, these are the towers. Here's something of a head scratcher to leave you with. There's now no aerial and there's now no ground. All I've got is a clip lead going round to this aluminium pie plate and There we go, receive him. Okay, thanks for watching.